I just said subscribe. Now. Okay, you know what? You're tired, I'm tired. Let's just make a quick speed tutorial. We can call it, yeah, a speed tutorial. Son of a... Okay, so for this tutorial, you only need two things, which is awesome. You need a chroma key card, which is basically like green screen, green paper per se. I just have mine here. It's just cardboard with green A4 paper. Nothing special, nothing expensive, like maybe a dollar. And you need a heck of a lot of free time, so... Let's get going. So this effect is really simple, it's really cheap. You need this for props and you know yourself. And it's it's lightning fast. I mean, whew, that's why I call it a speed tutorial because I, I I reckon we can do this in under 10 minutes, maybe. Okay, shooting plus editing, 15 minutes, I would say. So, you know, I'm just gonna whew, rush through this tutorial because it's, it's fairly simple, actually. Okay. You will need your three clips of the intro. I had to like time the Modern Family theme song, so I put that in first. And then you just take your clips where you're standing with the sign, and that's it. And then also to make things a bit more harder and a bit more fun, I chose to finish with myself three times, because you know, three, yeah, I guess there are three families in Modern Family, one family, it technicalities. So that one was a bit tricky, but you know, it's it's nothing more than a clone effect. You take yourself three times and make sure you're not intersecting each other clips and just mask out. It's maybe a process that takes two minutes of your time, but it brings such a value. I mean, it's amazing. I, I mean, it's, it's wonderful. Mwah! So yeah, just make sure you're not crossing where your other self should be, because that's... Come on, Funka. As we say. And when you've done that, you just place your clips like on top of each other, like maybe five, six frames into the other clip. And you use the effect called chroma key, put that on the green. This one. And if you put the chroma key on this, it should be like black until you put the clip under it. Then it should look like this. Oh my god. That's magic. Ha! <laughs> Amazing. So when you've done that on all the four clips, pretty much done. No, you need the transform effect. We could just zoom in regularly, but you don't get any motion blur with that. So, you know, motion blur is... Motion blur is your friend. You can hide a lot of editing mistakes. You can hide a lot of cuts in motion blur. And also it gives people a reference to speed. You know, if, if I move my hand, it should be blurry. You know, wind windshield wiper. So when you've done that, you just click the tick watch for the scale and the position, and then you move backwards, like six, seven frames, somewhere in that ballpark, and you zoom into the picture. I had to zoom in like times 500, times 600. You want the beginning of the clip to be covered by the chroma key. So like the beginning of the clip should look like this, and zoom out. So we want to do that in editing, in post. And then, very important step, you have to dis mark, uncheck the tick box for the use composition shutter speed and raise it to, I like somewhere between 250 and 360. It's just gonna give you a lot of motion blur, a lot of motion in the picture, which is great. And when you've done that for all the clips, I, no, I, I think we're done actually. Yeah, it's three things to do. You need two things to do the clip and three things in editing. Wow. And sure, I'm gonna say it. When I did it on the real intro in Modern Family, they tracked the clip that zooms out because you can see them moving in painting and the clip moves with it. I could have done that. I could have gone into After Effects maybe and tracked it or even in Premiere just manually rotate it. But like I said, I did this in 10 minutes so you get what you give. No, what? What more can you expect? So yeah, I mean, the frame could move around, but the picture inside would still be still. That said, I'm pretty happy with the effect. I mean, it's a quick effect, it's a fun effect, you know. You can go around in school, at your work, show these to your colleagues or classmates and say, Hey, look how much free time I have. I need a job. So yeah, that was the speed tutorial effect, Modern Family tutorial. 
by LSO, you should subscribe if you haven't. I mean, we, we do quite awesome things here. I mean, I do Modern Family intros and, you know, stuff. Yeah. No, but it's a fun and easy effect that looks way harder than it actually is. So, I mean, th that's that's where I like to share my my knowledge when you see an effect that you think, whoa, ho, ho, stop it again. That seems hard, but it's actually quite easy. Yeah. Okay, thank you guys for watching. I'm not going to take up any more of your time. I hope you're having a good day, and I will see you in the next tutorial. If you subscribe, you should subscribe. Yeah. yeah. And like as well. Okay, bye.